In this video, I'm going to show you how you can create your own SharePoint document library with Power Automate workflows. Now, the first thing you'll want to do is navigate to Power Automate with inside Office 365 and then click on the Create button on the left hand side to create your workflow. Now, I'm going to be creating this from scratch, but you might be integrating this into your system uh, already. Uh, when we click on the Instant Cloud Flow button, I'm just going to click on Skip just because I'm going to create a quick sort of proof of concept for you. I'm going to use my trigger as a flow button. Uh, so basically, it just means I can click a button to show you uh, this working. Next, I'm going to add my action to actually create my SharePoint document library. Now, when I go to add my action, you'll notice inside of SharePoint, there is no uh, action for creating a document library. Um, however, there is a send HTTP request to SharePoint. Now, this can be used uh, for free. It's not a uh, premium connector. Um, and we can use it for a whole host of things. Uh, and potentially, I'll be creating videos showing you how you can create SharePoint sites and other things that you can't do with out-of-the-box Power Automate um, actions. So the first thing you're going to do is you're going to set your site address of the SharePoint site that you're going to create your new document library on. So on here, I'm just going to select my uh, Dougie SharePoint site. The next thing is to set the method to post. And then we're going to copy and paste in our URI. And don't worry, all of the code that I'm going to be using will be found in the description of this video as well. And you can just copy and paste it in. So just paste in the URI into here, which should look a bit like that. And then we also need to go ahead and paste in um, the header. So just paste in uh, a content type into here. Uh, and then what we're accepting into the right hand box. And then what we need to do is paste in the, the following um, into the body section. So I'm just going to copy and paste this in. Oops, not that. Now, this is basically defining what it is we're going to be creating uh, in our SharePoint site. The base template is telling us that we're actually using the sort of 101, which is the template for a document library. We've got a description, so we can update this um, just with what a description of the document library is, and then the title as well. So I might want to call this my client documents, for example. Um, now, this is ready to go. So when I click on save, in fact, I might want to give my flow, my Power Automate uh, here a bit of a different name. Um, so I might want to say create a document library, just so it's clear afterwards what uh, this particular Power Automate workflow is doing. Then when I click on save, um, I can click on the test and click on I'll perform the trigger action. Click on test and this is going to then run my Power Automate workflow. It's the first time I'm using it, so it's just going to confirm my uh, connection. So I'm going to click on run flow. It's now confirmed that the flow has now run. So now if I go to my uh, SharePoint site, which is my Dougie site, and then click on the cog, click on site contents, I then see my client documents document library appear here. And when I click onto it, then I've got my full document library uh, ready to add files and folders within here. All of the code um, will be available in the description box that you can copy and paste in to create this yourself. I hope you enjoyed that video. If you need help, we do offer professional services, including bespoke development, pre-built solutions, training packages, as well as a pay-as-you-go support service, which bridges knowledge gaps within your existing team. All of our employees are based in the UK and have many years experience working with all sectors, from small companies to large enterprises. We offer a free consultation with a no obligation fixed price quotation. If that all sounds good, please feel free to contact me by emailing Dougie at valto.co.uk. Thank you for watching.